All right, I actually uh, was starting to work on it. That's why it's starting to get a little thingy. And I forgot, you know, no film. It, it cleaned up or cleared up real nice last night. Um, so not bad. I just now I'm going to vacuum this. I've got to be careful. My plecos are in here, I think. Uh, so I'll be real careful. I've got a little bit in the back over here to do and some over here to do. Mm, there's probably quite a bit in the front here to do, but I don't know. I'll move that and try and get it as best I can. And then it'll settle one more time. And then I'm going to get the cat in here. I can worry about putting the plants in, but I want to get him in here. All right, hold on. All right, I ain't going to wait no longer. I'm going to get this guy into the aquarium. <coughs> oh, that wasn't hard at all. There we go. might delay cleaning right now and just try to get him to eat see if he wants to eat so I'll do that and see what happens here in a little bit all right see he's toughing see how there is that white thing going back and forth Looks like fungus to me, and maybe in the tip of his fin right there too, but I don't know, I noticed it. I brought him home in a bucket, I thought it was stuff floating in the bucket, but I don't know. So, this first night he's in here, I'm going to keep my eye open, but... I treated the water for fungus, uh, just in case. Uh, if it's a fungal infection, I'm going to take care of it. It's supposed to be safe for everybody else in case there is anything. Don't need a problem starting to get this tank, you know, cleaned up. Uh, and uh, I want it to continue that, so we'll see how this goes. Oh man, I want this guy to make it. He's so awesome. Alright, I did a second run on that half. I cleaned some more of that off. Blah, blah, blah. I almost flushed my uh, female pleco down the drain when I was removing one of the logs. Didn't know he was under it. Same with the male. But they're okay. <laughs> the um, catfish, he went immediately down in there. He was hiding over here and over there earlier. But I had to work around them, got them in there. I've changed the filter a couple of times just to keep, you know, I was so bad. But um, everybody seems, I think everybody's here pretty much. I don't know. Uh, put the snails back in. Gave a bunch of them to uh, uh, a little dude. He had a feast. Um, so now, hopefully, I don't have a whole lot of them. That's why I was trying to keep as many as I could. But uh, they do produce fast, so they'll, they'll be back fast and soon enough. Planted the different plants. I am no expert at escaping, you know, so this is kind of what I got, you know. But planted the plants, put the pellets in like she told me. Sure, they'll probably uh, go through that transition like she said, die off, uh, so forth, so on. But that'll work, I mean, you know. But the tank should do a whole lot better, a whole lot better. Um, but uh, the trip to Michigan has been postponed. Uh, can't say why right now, but um, boss has postponed that right now. There's some things going on. So that's been postponed. We'll see what's on that later. Uh, it, it will happen, just not right this second. Uh, probably within a month or so. And, uh, you know, just got done watching the live show. And I tell you what, you know, this thing was covered. That was covered. A lot of the plastic plants. 
some of this, some of that is all getting, you know, dying off uh, the, the bearded algae. But it's going to take a while. I didn't actually ask Josh what the treatment is on it. So I'll get a hold of them. Uh, I wrote down the date, which I put it in, which just two days ago. Ah, oh, there's my buddy. Here's my crayfish. He's done very well. He's done very well. And these guys, they're just too big for him to mess with. I mean, he does. He'll go right up to them, but, you know, they run away. So, he's still doing good somewhere. I seen him the other day. Uh, I'll have to keep an eye, but I got the other uh, frog in here. There's one of the bristle noses. He just moved. He's underneath that one there. See him moving there? That's the male right there. I can see all the bristle noses on him. And the female, I seen her in there. So I got the two pair of bristle nose, the pair of bristle nose rather. I got the crayfish. I got the um, dwarf frog in here. Dawn's dwarf frog. I don't know, man. <laughs> it suckers like twice the size that it was before. But I'm going to let this set for like an hour or two. Because like I said, I was really messing with it. And uh, see if I can get it to clear up. In fact, I'll do the sponge filter one more time. Um, and see if I can get it to clear up any better. And get another really, really good view, view here. Uh, before the end of the evening. And then I think I'll get some... Uh, well, there's not any here today. He already ate a bunch. Uh, but I'll get some uh, blood worms or something for little dude. Stay tuned, people. All right, as promised, <laughs> little dude, he's waiting. He's seen it come over, <laughs> so I'm gonna let's see, see if I can run the camera and feed him at the same time. Uh, there you go, buddy. He loves, well, I should have wiped the front of the screen, I guess. He loves his blood worms. Actually, there's a couple different things he loves. Uh, I mean, the snails, he loves them too. But used to be able to only give them, uh, like everybody's like, he's growing. So I had to look back because <laughs> he really didn't look like he was growing much to me. But then I go back and I seen him on older videos and I'm like, yep, he is growing. And on top of that, I used to, you know, give him like half a cube. Then it was three quarters of a cube. And now <laughs> he's already, and I can feel every time he goes up and pulls one off my finger, I can feel it. Ooh, there you go, buddy. But uh, now... No, he's up to a whole cube. I used to give the rest of it to the guppies and Don's tank, but he's, <laughs> I love it. It's like spaghetti. He sucks him up. Uh, and see, his belly, it's not really, you know, that baby can get twice as big. So here, give him some more. There you go, buddy. He can tug. I can feel the tugs. It's awesome. <laughs> He's neat. But he is, he is a scaredy cat. If, uh, you know, somebody walks by too fast or whatever, he'll run. I opened it up a little earlier. I didn't get it all just to scrape up and clean up a little. I, actually, I was cleaning the front of his tank. And he went nuts. He started swimming around. That's why I can't keep anybody with him. He just... He's just not into it. He's a loner. But now, look at how big that belly's getting. Yeah, it's getting up there. He bit me once, but not really. I mean, it was more on my nail. So, it wasn't bad. Uh, yeah, that's it, buddy. Whatever's left floating around. And he'll get every piece. Like the other night when I threw all that batch, you know, cleaning the tank. And I threw that batch of uh, snails in. He loves the snails, too. I 
think maybe snails is his best and favorite food. Bloodworm second. I don't know. They're close. But, and I have like three huge. I started with one little one. And they have grown so much. I got to do another cleaning on the tank. I know. No big deal. But I um, uh, got to get out to Richest tomorrow. Uh, seen the live show. It was awesome. So get out there. Get that thing done like he said. Because he's got to be back by three. And uh, that'll work. Um, and then, uh, you know, come home. Take care of some more things. Check my other tanks and see how they're doing. But in the meantime, you guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, you guys stay fishy, my friends. Hit that. Oh, and I'm sorry. Every and anybody that has uh, donated to that fun rich started. I can't believe it's like 2400 bucks. I can't believe it. My brother, he, uh, he said he would uh, match the first 10. That was like eight hundred and uh, or two hundred, two hundred and eighty-five dollars, and uh, he said uh, he's he's gonna match that no problem. In fact, he said uh, he's got something better in mind. So, uh, and I heard Big Rich saying something on a live uh, stream about somebody donating something. So I'll have to check that out tomorrow as well. But in the meantime, you guys, you guys stay fishy, my friends. You hit that like, subscribe, and share. And thank you, everybody, so much from the bottom of my heart. And uh, we'll go deeper with the Reaper. Thank you, everybody.